De La Wright, my envies. Welcome. Elders of the Palace of Oni of Ife are rumored to have, you know, held Oni of Ife's sister down to go and take an oath of innocence over what happened to the food of the Oni of Ife. Now, what we are hearing is that, the, the, you know, a lot of stuff are happening to the Oni of Ife again, again, over the fact that a, a, a foreign deity was brought into the palace and they had given Oni an instruction that he must not eat a food within a time frame and right now they say that what they asked him not to do, he did. Out of Was it an act of omission? Was it some kind of mistake? Was it deliberate or what? Nobody knows. Dr. Elizabeth has gone to the shrine and insisted she was going to swear and they said that without looking back, she held the authority that you used to take an oath and she swore and she left. That before they would even know what was happening, that she, she, she swore that she was not. Whether that oath she took was effective or not is not what I was not there. I do not know. But they said that she had to swear, swear because there was an Ifa priest there and all of that she had to swear. Now, with that being said, it means that she's completely innocent. She knows nothing about what had happened. And so right now with the vision, even Queen Naomi has confirmed that Dr. Elizabeth knows nothing. Now, with the vision that Queen Naomi saw, um, everybody is suspecting the sister and everybody. And right now, not um, the judgment from the um, elders is not based on the, on the vision. They said they saw findings and they said that they, sh they did some findings and they asked that they should hold the sister responsible. The sister has got something to say. The sister has to start talking. And so right now they are holding the sister to go and take an oath of innocence over what happened to the meal of the Oni of Ife. You know something? Yeah. Yagba had already warned Nami before that anybody who is coming to collect meals that should hold the staff of authority. And to the glory of God, if that thing had not come earlier, uh, you know, there is this thing, a lot of people are feeling that this whole thing was even masterminded to get Olori Naomi into trouble at the mm -hmm. very beginning. But with the way things are going now, it's, it, you know, God is always on the side of Queen Naomi. God is always working to put her enemies into shame. With the way things are going going now. Everybody knows that Naomi did what she was supposed to do. There's no way these women would have connived with Naomi. There's no way. It's either from Dr. Elizabeth or from the sister. But a lot of people are saying it's from the sister to the only of Ife. They say um, uh, pro Naomi elders are busy dragging left, right, and center that she, if she knows that she knows nothing about the food. Because from the um, uh, forest of Udua. They said that everything that is plaguing the Oni of Ife right now came from something that he ate and uh, 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 something that he had been told not to eat. That is what is plaguing him. And that is why he's not able to make great decisions anymore like um, he used to make that these women actually did this to turn his back, his eyes away from Queen Naomi. And usually anytime they do things like that to turn Oni's eyes away from Queen Naomi, it tends to affect um, so much. Um, they came out of this like um, uh, uh, eight months ago that Oni has plunged into it again because of the fact that they could not keep to simple instruction that was given to them not to eat meals that are not prepared um, by Olori Naomi. So right now they are asking the sister if there's anything she needs to say. If there was a time they left the food or something or something, nobody knows. But um, uh, Dr. Elizabeth says she knows nothing about it. And uh, they have asked, she, of course, even if, you know, she innocently left the food and somebody did something, it wouldn't be her. Because they said if it had been her, there's no way she would have rushed to go and take an oath. That these oaths are not things that you play with, that they are very, very dangerous. You cannot even try it if you're not innocent. And so she rushed to go and take that oath. What it means is that she's completely innocent of anything. But right now, Going by what they are saying, they say they have done their own findings. From their findings, they are saying that she will act on his sister. And um, um, with the fact that 
Oni um, and Nami also said she saw a vision that that woman knows something about it. Now, they said they are dragging her that if she knows that she is innocent, she should go ahead and take the oath. Will Oni allow that or not? Because he might not allow. He doesn't like it when people are forced to take oath. You know, Oni is very educated and exposed. He is a liberal man. So whether Oni is going to allow this or not, this is the situation. But they said this is the problem that is happening in the palace right now as it is rumored. I'm going to bring you more update. I appreciate you so much. Thank you.